Blue Point, the all blue far side. Behind those soldiers call and then comes Mabs Cross. Uh, head towards the line, Blue Point in front. Bashar's nearest to us, trying to get to him, but it's the same as last year. Blue Point from Bashar's, Mabs Cross and Soldier Point, very tight third and fall. I guess the, the word to describe it would be electric. Um, it was a really tough performance. Uh, he showed a great turn of foot again. On, on ground, that's probably slightly easier than, than he prefers, but I thought it was a tremendous performance. Uh, it was a great race with Batash obviously in there again. Uh, the two of us dueling at the furlong pole, it, it, it was a great spectacle. It's Pinatubo preserving his unbeaten record and is going to be a resounding winner of the Chesham Stakes under James Doyle. Impressive Pinatubo beats Lope Fernandez convincingly. He's a great sprinter. That's what we can create a bit of history. Blue Point all out, dream of dreams is thrusting. Blue Point near side, Blue Point. Blue Point, dream of dreams. Has he done it? Has he done the double? He may have just lost it, it's tight. We uh, contemplated uh, running this horse back after his victory in the King Stand, but uh, the first person to call me on Wednesday morning was His Highness Sheikh Mohammed to inquire how the horse was, and he'd eaten up, and so therefore we just gave him an easy day on, on, the, on the Wednesday and an easy day Thursday, hacked him on Friday. He's, he's a regular swimmer, which he enjoys, so he swam during the course of the week there, and uh, more importantly, when he got on the horse box this morning, he was the same weight as what he was on Tuesday morning before the King Stand, so I was confident we had the horse back in his peak condition. He travelled as he always does supremely well. Two to the one there, he was travelling as, as good as I've ever seen him. Uh, I must admit the last 150 yards I got a little bit uh, a little bit anxious but uh, James Doyle always felt he was, he was well in hand and uh, he couldn't understand why there was a photo finish but it's probably easier for him riding than us watching. So smooth and James always looked happy. It was just the last part where he really had to grind it out and he did. You know, He's got a big heart um, and what an achievement by, by the horse, the trainer and Sheikh Mohammed as well, and James, of course. You know, it's a great, great achievement, and um, you know, I, I only have admiration for for everybody involved and the horses, especially. A fantastic double, and really huge credit to Charlie Appleby and his team to uh, have the you know bravery and nous to nail such a historic uh, achievement. He's like he's like my baby, you know. He's he's so good, genuine, big heart. Wow. It's just a wow. Yeah.